Hello and welcome to the John Art Show. Today's episode is called Risk-Free Gambling. Before we begin, I want to encourage you to subscribe to our channel for free. You can also like, comment, and follow us. Make sure to send a link of this episode to all your friends to spread the word. We're going to have a lot of great celebrities coming up, so make sure to click on that notification bell so you can be notified every time we upload a new episode. Now, let's get started. Some casinos are now so desperate to try and get people to start gambling that they're offering something called risk-free gambling. Here's how it works. Wait till you hear this. Let's say you walk into a casino or you go online and you decide to bet $500. Now, most people would think they'd be very leery about that because if you lose $500, that's quite a dent in the wallet for most people. So what the casinos are now doing is if you lose your first bet, let's say it's $500, they will then give you $500 of free betting right after that just to keep the process going. The idea being to get new customers to overcome their fear of losing money so that they can get addicted to the whole gambling process and get them desensitized to the notion of losing money. Casinos are all about desensitizing you to the, uh, to the notion of losing more of your money. That's why there are no windows in a casino. That's why, you know, they're so anxious to get you drunk in a casino. You know how drug dealers like to give away free drugs to first-time drug users just to get them addicted and seduced and turn them into repeat customers? Same principle here. The casino wants first-timers to stick their toe in the, in the gambling waters and get used to gambling. More importantly, get used to, uh, to losing. They know that once people give it a try, a certain percentage of them will turn into lifelong gamblers. And that's what they really want. Repeat customers. We don't know how many casinos are trying this strategy now, but there are some. Uh, and I suspect that it's going to be a very successful uh, strategy. Why? If it works for drug dealers, why wouldn't it work for gamblers? I also suspect that it'll increase the amount of people being addicted to gambling. I know that years ago when they started opening casinos in the Midwest, that the, gambling, uh, the rate of gambling addiction and the number of bankruptcies both skyrocketed. People would build up a huge amount of gambling debt and then they would go and refinance their homes. They'd take a lot of money, a lot of equity out of their home. They'd use some of it to pay off their enormous gambling debt. And then they would take the rest of that money and go straight to the casino that same weekend. I'll tell you something else no one talks about. And that's how suicides increase dramatically when a new casino uh, is opened up in your area. Why is that? Because once some people start gambling, they can't stop. It's just not in them. They'll lose everything. They just keep gambling until they empty their savings account, their retirement accounts, and they lose their homes. Then, in a lot of cases, they decide to take what little money they have left and they'll make a pact with God. They'll say, God, I'm going to go to the casino today and try one more time. And if you really love me and you care for me, you'll help me win. And guess what happens? God doesn't intervene. They lose everything. And of course, what do they do next? They go up to the top of the nearest floor and they leap off the building and commit suicide, just like that. What's really interesting is that these casino suicides almost never get any news on the local news stations. Why is that? Because the local news stations receive so much advertising revenue from the casinos uh, that they promote that they don't want that money to stop coming in so they tend not to run stories that are detrimental to the casinos. What a shock. Welcome to the wonderful world of gambling. Thank you for watching. I want to encourage you to subscribe to our channel for free. You can also like, comment, and follow us. We're going to have a lot of great celebrity interviews coming up, so make sure to click on that notification bell so you can be notified every time we upload a new story. And make sure to share the link to this show with all your friends. Thank you, and we shall see you soon. Goodbye.